Hey guys, we're at the Printing United Expo in Las Vegas at the Barberry uh, booth. And we're here with Victor all the way from Italy to talk about color profiling and what this really cool equipment is that is extremely important if you're a digital printer. You know, digital printing, you have your classic CMYK and now there's a lot of other colors you could throw at it. But that only works if you actually know how to get to that color. And, and talk to us about, yeah, what this technology is, what is a spectrometer, and yeah, why is it so important for digital printing? Yeah, thank you, Zach, yeah, for, uh, for interviewing me. Uh, so uh, we are a company in Barbieri from Italy. We manufacture spectrophotometers, color measurement instruments for digital printing. The beauty about Barbieri is that you can truly measure all digitally printed materials in the world. The purpose is that no matter if you print on textile, on wood, on carpet, on paper, no matter where, you want to have the right color. Like if you be, would be a brand, so Coca-Cola, Pepsi, you want to have your specific red, your specific blue. And to achieve that, you need to tell the printer, hey, this is the measurement data. Print that hinter. And with that data then, uh, make sure that my color comes out as I want it to be out of the printer. So what you do is you print some test charts, as you see here. This is on a textile. You measure it, fully automated with the Barbieri. It scans. There are some challenges or so some special features if you measure textile. There would be some other challenges like you measure print on glass. In that case, see how it scans. And with that measurement data, the printer then knows exactly how he needs to convert his, let's say, his brand color red, that it comes out the same on a textile, on a carpet, on a wallpaper, or any other material that you digitally print. So again, it doesn't matter if it's sign, apparel, and, and one thing that's really important, it needs to be the final product that it's gonna go on, right? Like apparel in this case, you don't wanna measure you know, one step prior, it's the final color that we're trying to get to. Correct. You will always, always print this test chart on the final material, like the final application, and then you will measure there. That's called like creating the profile. And then you have your profile, which guarantees you that you have accurate colors on the material, printer, and ink combination. And how much does like a setup like this run? Oh, it's a awesome price. So it's a good value. And it starts, the solution start at around $5,900, goes up to 15, 20K, depending on the optionals, what you want to have. But that's a price range for fully automated spectrophotometer. Well, and again, everybody is getting into digital printing these days. How do you differentiate yourself from somebody else? Accurate colors. Yes. Those who take the time to do this properly are setting themselves apart from the competition. Correct. Even a step further, you're not just profiling your printer, but you want to do quality control. Like, not just printing right today, but printing right tomorrow, the next week, and in a year. And you always say, yeah, I know what my printer prints, and I know that I hit the right colors. So, you make a great point. You should be kind of testing it every once in a while right. to compare, okay, when we dialed it in the first time, are we still hitting those exact colors still today? Correct, correct. And as we know today, many co uh, customers run in, they have some sample and say, okay, I want this. And then they come back a year later, I want to have the exact same print. To achieve that, you need to be very well aware of what your printer can do. And you need to measure yeah. in order to prove yes. That is the color that I want to hit, that I can hit today. And one thing Victor brought up is being able to match different types of substrates, those exact colors, or in the apparel world, you've got a lot of DTF, and a lot of shops are on like their second or their third printer. They want all those printers to hit the exact same colors. Yeah. It's gonna be pretty much impossible without taking the time to do this, right? Correct, yeah, like you described maybe the holy grail problem of every print shop, having a few printers, all should match. The only way to achieve that is to bring color charts, measure them, 
let the software do their magic. But anyway, base of everything is to have accurate measurement data, and then you get the most out of your printers. Awesome. Where can our viewers go to learn more about Barberry? Yeah, so uh, we are here at Printing United. We have a website, so barbarextronic.com. Uh, yeah, you find us on the internet, you can call us. We're always happy to help with our knowledge. Again, guys, keep this in mind. You know, you just buying a printer, setting it up, that's one thing, especially in, you know, with a lot of different type of equipment, colors may be different, you know, in one part of the country from another. It doesn't make a lot of sense, but you really need one of these to dial in the colors for your shop, for your equipment, especially if you're doing different types of substrates um, and you have different types of printers. You don't want to get, have to always use that same one each time. You want everything to be consistent. So thank you so much, Victor. Guys, check out barberry.com. Barberryextronics.com. Electronic.com. Yes. Thank All you right. so much. Thanks, guys.